Yo, suck a fat guys. Okay, you want to unlock your boost order, right? Then I think you're in the right place to do so because I think that I've just made the best video on how to unlock your boost order on the LG G7. So let's get started. Okay, first, before we begin this guide, um, let me tell you the thing we are going to need. First is the um, G7 Unlock Archive. In it, you'll find QFIL, the Drivers Folk, the QPST or 9008 mode. You'll find the LG G7 Fire Hose, so that your computer can communicate directly with your SOC. And then you'll find the, all the tools you'll need to flash your device. And then you need to download the LG Drivers um, on LG's website or any or else that's safe. And then in the settings, we are going to turn on OEM unlock in the settings and then last what we are going to, to need is electricity, a computer and a USB cable. Again, let's get started. Okay, the first step is going to flash the engineered ABL. So to do that, you're going to need to boot into EDL mode. And to do that, you're going to press the power and then the volume button together. And as soon as the screen turns off, I'm going to repeatedly press on the volume up button and then the screen will stay off and then you will hear the, the disconnection and connection sound in your computer that means that your phone is on EDL mode and if it doesn't if the phone reboot that means that you you failed with the button com combination so you'll need to do the process again and then you'll need to set up QFIL um install QFIL install the drivers go open the QFIL first you're going to set the build type to flat build the storage type to UFS and then you, you'll need to load the fire hose from the online G7 archives. Next, you'll need to check the port manager because QFIL will save the partition you save under COM port as a subdirectory for your partition save. So that is kind of important if you use QFIL a lot. Okay, now go to partition manager. Search for ABLA. You will right click and then you'll press read data to save the partition but because the file aren't um, saved as abla.bin etc it's saved as read name etc so you're going to go you're going to save the partition and then go to the file explorer and then rename it to abla backup.bin and then after saving and rename it we are going to flash the engineered abl to it Okay, so if um, for context why we did that is because the non-EM version of the LG G7 weren't made to be unlocked. So because the V35 can be unlocked pretty easily, we are going to flash the um, V35 engineered ABL to the G7 because they're using pretty much the same SOC and they're kind of the same thing. Okay, step two, we are going to activate fastboot by removing the download mode. But if you're using a EM variant of the LG G7, you don't really need you don't need to do that because your phone already has real uh, functioning fastboot mode. So what you're going to do is just press the volume minus button and then connect the USB cable if you're using a um, EM variant. But if you're using any other variant out there except T-Mobile because they can't be unlocked, you are going to remove the download mode. So to do that, we are going into the queue field again. We're going to search for LEFA. So you will right click, read data to save it. Rename the red bin file to LEFA um, backup, I don't know. And then um, we are going to delete it. When we get rid of the two LEF files, we'll be able to go into fastboot mode. So, again, what we're going to do is back up LEFA, rename the LEFA in Explorer, erase LEFA on QFIL, repeat for LEFB now. If you're on EM, press the volume man minus button and then connect the USB cable. If your phone is not a EM variant, you're going to press the volume plus button and then connect the USB cable and you'll go straight to fastboot mode. Unplug your phone, then reboot by holding the volume down and power button for 15 to 30 seconds. As soon as the screen goes black, hold only the volume up, then plug your phone. I think you will also hear the disconnection sound from your computer. This will get you into fast boot mode. If not, reboot again by pressing volume down with the power for 15 to 30 seconds, then press the volume down until you get 
to fastboot. Yeah, it's complicated. Go to the location where the ADB fastboot files are located, or you can just press the window button, then search for minimal, right click on it, and then open file location. Press shift plus right on any empty space and select open power shell window here. Enter CMD and hit enter. Type fastboot OEM unlock and it should say erasing user data. If it says unknown command, try with another USB 2.0 port if or figure out the problem with your drivers. Try unplugging, then plugging back a device. Try to run the command fastboot devices to see if the connection is okay. If, not, if nothing appears, try to install the Google drivers. A link will be down in, in the description. Trust me, it'll work with another version of Windows. And then, my next problem was that I couldn't load any partition inside, inside the QFill. I got Sarah errors again. But Fastboot was working, so I just used the command flash LAFA, then drag the LAFA to the CMD windows. Which worked, then I proceeded to flash the LAFA by typing fastboot flash LAFA, then drag and hit enter, and again flash boot flash LAFB, drag then enter. And then afterwards, um, download the latest KDZ for your variant, and then go to download mode after you first started it by um, pressing the volume plus button and then connecting the phone and it'll go to download mode and you'll and you'll launch LG up and then press partition DL and then flash it to get rid of the V35 ABL. So that was it. I think I'm I hope that video that video was simpler and more and I give more explanation than the first one that I did. I don't know. I, I I'm trying to grow our following base. So I don't know. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram because they're nearly empty so yeah that's been it for today's video like if you liked it subscribe if you love it and i will see you in the in the next one until then peace out